There are various methods for analyzing water. With AquaCheck, Sol takes advantage of photometry, a measuring technique well known from physics and chemistry. The AquaCheck photometer enables you to determine up to 11 water parameters with lab level precision, but independently from laboratories. We want to show you the simple handling of the device by using the examples of the pH value and the phosphate test. Irrespective of the substance you are looking for, you always have to measure twice per parameter. That is why always two of the sample tubes included in the AquaCheck sets are to be filled with the test water. To make sure that the tubes are firm during the analysis, we recommend that you put them into the holes of the mini-laboratory. Please watch that the water level matches the black mark in each of the tubes. To measure the pH value, open the small bottle with the respective label. Add 12 drops of this orange indicator liquid to one of the tubes. Then close the screw top lid. Mix the indicator liquid and the water by lightly shaking the sample. Afterwards, you open the sample and place the tube into the mini lab. Now the preparations are already finished. Switch on AquaCheck by pressing and holding the power key. After the welcome message has been displayed, continuous pressing of the select key guides you through the menu. When you have found the desired parameter, in this case the pH value, please confirm your choice by pressing OK. First of all, you have to carry out the reference measurement. Insert the measuring sensor of AquaCheck into the untreated test water. To prevent air bubbles on the lens of the sensor, lightly stir the liquid. In the second step, AquaCheck has to be inserted into the colored sample. Pressing the OK key activates the measuring process. Immediately afterwards, the photometer displays the measurement result digitally. Now we attend to the phosphate test. For this purpose, the same preparations have to be made. First, you fill two sample tubes with the water you want to analyze. Unscrew the bottle with reagent number 1, R1, for phosphate. Add 9 drops of this liquid to one of the plastic tubes. Then you mix the two substances. As two chemicals are required for the phosphate test, we have to fill in a second reagent, R2. Open the disposable ampoule carefully and then add the liquid completely to the same tube. Then you mix the liquids once again. Now you have to wait for 5 minutes for a complete chemical interaction. The AquaCheck 2 set comprises a timer that allows you to meet the specific reaction rates. Choose the desired parameter from the device menu and confirm by pressing the OK key. At first you measure the pure reference and then the light blue sample water. Again, AquaCheck indicates the results immediately, after the second measurement. In many waters, phosphate occurs in trace amounts. Due to a special characteristic, AquaCheck can detect even low concentrations of phosphate without any difficulties. When the phosphate concentration is lower than 0.16 mg per liter, a less than sign is being displayed. After confirming this display, the device asks you to pull out the measuring tube. Now you have to carry out the measuring process once more. Thanks to this mechanical feature, the lower limit of the measuring range for phosphate is 0.01 mg per liter. As you have seen, water analysis with AquaCheck is not only precise, but very easy, because the two-key operation facilitates an intuitive handling of the photometer. With AquaCheck by Sol, you can make your water transparent.